Hello, hi, I'm the Megabum, and I'm here to talk about Xbox 720. Well, we, no one knows what it's really called, but we'll just we'll just call it the Xbox 720 for now. It uh, it's they ugh, recently Microsoft has employed tons of people, and they're still employing, and they, the numbers are skyrocketing right now. And if you look at all the applications, you could just Google search an application for Microsoft and look what they're what they're looking for. It's uh <clears throat> basically to build another console. And all the other big people, like IGN, all people who predict these kind of things, and instead of it being in the ten years uh, system cycle, which would mean the Xbox 720 would come out in 2015 looks that like it would really come out in 2013 and the reason I say that is because when uh, Microsoft hired people for the Xbox 360 and the numbers skyrocketed like this it took two more years after that for them to uh, <clears throat> completely have the system done. But I mean, we had the Red Rings problem. Uh, yeah, it's okay. Not really. Hopefully, maybe maybe even 2014 if they don't have any Red Ring problems. But P I know people will complain that they don't want to spend the extra $300 or whatever it's going to cost. 400 But Everyone from PC pays that price. Every what couple of years they gotta buy a new, either upgrades or a whole new computer because it's too old. <coughs> but I think that if they get the system out relatively soon, within the next couple of years, I would be. As long as there's no Red Rings problems, more than willing to buy it. As soon as it comes out. Because, as we know, these games, if anybody's watched Frostwire, or uh, not Frostwire, Battlefield 3 uh, gameplay videos, these engines are getting so much stronger and can do so much more that you're going to be able to do all this. You're going to be able to need, you won't, uh, you won't be able to do all this. You're going to need a uh, the next upgrade, which would be the Xbox 720, and <clears throat> to get these, you know, kick-ass games that we would all love to play, uh, talking about the new systems, though, if this is true, then the PS4, so to speak, we'll just call it that, we have no clue, may come out, then... 2014, 2015, but <clears throat> we all know there won't be no problems there, and it's most likely gonna cost moolah to play online, just like the Xbox. But then everybody would get their <clears throat> map packs or whatever you want to call them, add-ons, DLC, all that sh good shit at the same time. Besides, you know, PC gamers wouldn't get it. They, they'd get it a month after, so I think that'd be pretty cool. Not hating on them, just that they just download some new hardware, they got a brand new thing. Just say, Maybe Xbox needs to do that. And uh, PS3. Download uh, some new software every year or two. Cost some money, and you wouldn't have to buy a new console. I think that's a pretty good idea. Maybe this new Xbox 720 would uh, have a 6 CD changer. Because how many people like honestly like getting up in the middle of a game? Or when your friends switch games and you want you got to get up and switch games with them, I think it'd just be nice to have a 6 CD changer. They got them in cars. I think they could put a, find a way to fix them into a console. No. But this game is coming to an end very soon. And 
the game is actually the team goes 75 and 18. We were all pretty much just destroying. Uh, I don't even know how good I do, but it's okay. Um, I, I promised that this would be a Fortress Craft video, but since this is breaking news, I thought I'd make a video of this first. But, uh, God, my throat is dry. Ooh, man, what a nice double spray. Well, that's the game. I'm the Mega Bomb. If you have any questions, message me. Uh, message me. Not message me. Unless you're a lady. But, uh, I'm the Mega Bomb, and I'm out.